Good morning, everyone. Headed to the bus now. And I'm so glad that I started leaving the house earlier. Let me pause this. Make sure. Okay, okay. No. And last night I had I got to practice my Spanish, like speaking it a bit with a girl from Peru that I had met through the website italki I told you all about and the Spanish vloggers I told you all about I had found when I was just searching on YouTube they make some pretty good vlogs and I put their channel in the description so y'all can check them out I believe their nombre es Duos Vita or Vita if I'm pronouncing it correctly but I'm glad I work in the morning shift. It feels so good to be home right now. And today, work was great. I wish you could. Oh, the tomatoes here. Left the light on. But, anyways, yeah, I got to learn a little bit more French. Because it was a song called Je ne t'aime plus. And it was a couple from Montreal. And he was telling me how they speak French there. Well, basically, like they're native French speakers, and we're just asking him bonjour and au revoir. I thought I had the correct meaning of it, and he said, Yeah, I did, and it's pretty awesome. Uh, and oh, another thing, my the manager, the well, store manager, I guess he makes the schedule, he was saying that now they're going to have me on three days a week opening, and he said, it's eventually going to get up to up to five days a week, so I'm opening every day of the week. So I was like, yes, thank goodness. Because I love being home when the sun is out. Less of a stress for me. And plus, since I go to work at five, I mean, wake up at five in the morning, that's plenty of time for me to do what I need to do before it's time for me to go to work. So I came across this video that was unbelievable. It was like nothing I've ever seen before. It was of an eagle, I believe it was a bald eagle, swooping down to get a fish out of the lake. And it went down a couple of times and like it picked it up but not all the way. And then it went back a couple more times. And then you see it swoop down and grab on to the fish and it starts swimming to the bank. It is so crazy. I'll put that video in the description so you are. I'm just getting chills thinking about it because I never knew eagles could do that. And like the person in the video had said, I've never seen an eagle sit on water. But that is amazing. Uh oh, getting surgical with it. Yeah, I'm going to open this up and then I'm going to take me a little nappy nap. Uh, 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 uh. This should be good to ride in the morning. Hope it's not too hard to put together. Say so for the past couple of days, I kind of felt as if I was lost. Not in a physical say, but in a mental way because I didn't have, I didn't write down any goals to accomplish for this week. So as soon as I, like a, uh, <laughs> Shiza, or Hoder. Okay, I'm, okay, I'm together now. As I was trying to say that I felt that I was just living without having anything to accomplish. So I said to myself, it's just like, Okay, you wrote down some goals, but you only wrote two, and that those are really not hard to do at all. So, after I wrote down some more goals, I instantly felt so much better. Uh, that nap was needed. Let me show you all what I had just read, <laughs> read on Reddit. Somebody had said, my first thought when I saw how much student loan debt I have. Let me click on it. <laughs> Because if y'all didn't know that if you fake your death, 
all your loans are forgiven or you don't have to pay your student loans or something like that i'm gonna go ahead and put this bike together really quick hopefully to be quick Then he has his pencil set. I am so jealous. But I feel awesome. And I'm gonna tell him that. Let you start you're starting to draw now.